Hello there. I figured the best way to start was to explain the difference between these two types of harmonica. Uh, to be completely clear, there's a lot, and I mean a lot, of types of harmonica. We have bass harmonica, coarse harmonica, tremolo harmonica, octave harmonica, and the list goes on and on. There are some other variants, but they are just crazy inventions like this. I know. Anyway, these were created after the two main types of harmonic, diatonic and chromatic, and the obvious difference to, for anyone who had seen them is size. Because size matters. Okay, maybe I exaggerated, but chromatic actually has more or less the double of the length of the diatonic, let alone it usually has 12 holes instead of 10. But beyond that, there's a feature in chromatic harps which make the little diatonics pail despair and beg for mercy in their power of their chromatic successor and this is this little thing. Yep, chromatics have a little button, that's it. Well, actually, this button pushes a metal plate who blocks half of the holes in the instrument to make the other half of the holes accessible. This is the way chromatic harmonicas end up having 48 notes. Uh, well, kind of 48. They're really 37. And that's also the reason why playing semitones is easier. So you just have to know the location of your notes and when to push the button. By the way, this performance by Franz Schmel, <laughs> I don't even know if I'm pronouncing it well, but... Uh, it's amazing, just uh, an incredible performance, if you want to check it out, i leave the link in the description. And I can hear you asking, but what about the tunics? Can, can they play semitones? Do they have less notes? Will, will they ever be able to reach the power level of their chromatic successor? I'll give you the answer, but I can see you're not subscribed. So, I won't give you this basic info which you can find in Wikipedia. Actually, no, Wikipedia doesn't know this. So, yeah, I'm just gonna wait here until you're, you're subscribed. Yeah. Okay, okay. Can they play semitones? Can they ever aspire to reign over the extent of the chromatic world? The answer is. Yes, yes they can. As some of you might have heard, a diatonic harmonica is tuned in a single key, which means all of the 20 notes you can play, uh, well, kind of 20, those are going to be natural tones of the key. However, there are a couple of techniques which can allow you to reach semitones between those natural notes. These techniques are called bend and over. Bend is the most known of the two because of the blues. That little sound. Each one of these techniques will grant you access to certain semitones, and if you master both, you can even do this. In case you're wondering, yep, that's a chromatic scale. So, there you have it. That's the real difference between diatonic and chromatic harmonicas. Both can play a chromatic scale but there's a different method to do it so yeah there's still a lot to be said about all of this so if you have any doubts or want me to explain any further uh, leave me a comment to let me know um, leave a like and keep those bands going <laughs>